Lots of sunshine. Our dew point temperatures are going to climb up into the mid to upper 60s. So that's a measure of moisture at the surface. So more water vapor means it's harder for our bodies to cool, and that's what's going to make it feel like 100 degrees later this afternoon, along with the 95 degree high temperature and a lot of sunshine. I can't rule out a pop up shower or thunderstorm in that heat and humidity this afternoon, but odds are we stay dry for our fireworks celebrations this evening from 9 to 11. A light breeze. You're going to feel warm and muggy with temperatures in the 80s. Thunderstorm chances don't increase until after midnight here in Kansas City. We might see those storms sneak into Maryville and Hiawatha between 10 o'clock and midnight, but you can see a lot of the rain and storms on future scan don't make it to I-35 until 3, 4 o'clock tomorrow morning, and then they'll continue into central and northern Missouri Wednesday morning. Wednesday afternoon, a slight chance of a few showers or storms, especially down near Lake of the Ozarks. We're going to make it a lake week down near the Lake of the Ozarks at I-44. Some of the storms overnight and tomorrow afternoon could produce hail and strong wind gusts. So please make sure you have the KBC app on your phone. I know you're going to be away from your house. That way, if there's any uh, alerts issues, you'll get those on the phone so you can get off the lake. And then look at the impact the front has on the temperatures as we head into the weekend for the Taylor Swift concert. We're going to take the edge off the excessive heat and humidity. We do have the chance of a thunderstorm Friday afternoon and evening and then off and on chances over the weekend.